welcome to my channel. Um, I am Anya and I'm an independent Cincy consultant and I wanted to do um, sort of like a little series on the class extent that Cincy offers with each catalog regardless of the season. Um, and I wanted to kind of touch base on a six pack that I just recently purchased um, and I kind of wanted to just go over some of these bars that I got. So I got a six pack um, and I just wanted to kind of explain um, the notes on these specific bars and maybe they'll peak your your nose and maybe peak your nose. <laughs> um, maybe be something you'd be interested in for your own home fragrance. Um, so the first bar I got is Palm Trees and Ocean Breeze. And this is new to the catalog for this year. Um, and it's in the fresh category. And it's a very pretty, like, mm, I'll say almost a teal wax. And one thing I love about our bars is that they come with the categories imprinted on the back of the clamshell as well as the wax. Um, so Palm Trees and Ocean Breeze. Oh, it's, it's, this is my first time um, having this bar this year. Oh, and it's just, a, it's like aquatic with salty notes. I know there's palm fronds in this. Like ocean freshness. This would be a really good scent, um, you know, just to freshen up your space if you're wanting that that fresh water sort of vibe within your home so i really do enjoy that one and also i apologize i'm working with <laughs> i don't set up but i'm it's um I'm, this is this is my first go around so hopefully uh within this video within maybe any comments that get posted you guys can give me some suggestions because that would be amazing uh, next up is amazon rain and it is a lovely, I would say a soft mossy green. Um, this is one of my absolute favorites. And it has been in the catalog for as long as I've been a consultant. Um, which was 2018 when I joined. Um, Amazon Rain especially is like a medley of things. You have like coconut milk, you've got melon, you've got night blooming jasmine. But to me, like I don't smell any of the notes that are describing this specific scent. Excuse me. Um, to me, Amazon Rain is just a really good, it's a good take on a, on a fresh green smell without being like leafy. It's comforting. Um, when I first became a consultant, I was obsessed with the Amazon Rain laundry line. Um, and I would get so many compliments on, you know, the way that my clothes smelled or the way that I smelled when I walked in the room and everyone was like, what is that? I'm like, oh, it's Amazon Rain from Scentsy. They're like, oh, I need that in my life. So, um, this is just a really good staple. This is also in the fresh category. I don't know how there's any fruit in this because I'm not picking up fruit. Like I just smell like a creamy, fresh, cozy sort of profile with this one so this one I can't wait to warm this it's been a few it's actually been some time since I've warmed this um probably a good year um so this is a good staple to have regardless of the season fall winter spring summer it's awesome okay next up is a cult favorite amongst the Sensi community it is bonfire beach this one is in the woods category um, and I love this green. It's like a light pastel green. Um, this one, oh, okay. <laughs> this one's in our woods category. You get toasted marshmallow. There's supposedly like flint and salty ocean side vibes with this. I would say it's like a masculine marshmallow scent. Um, and this is actually the first time I've owned this bar. <laughs> so I'm rather excited to 
warm this and I feel like this would be a really good bedroom scent um and but for me like I also don't really categorize my scents based on location of where I'm warming them um sometimes I'm a mood warmer and I'm looking forward to warming this wherever my heart desires <laughs> and I'm, I'm I'm really excited about this one I'm just I also like the artwork I don't know if you can see like they always put like little details in the background and I love that okay so my next two scents are from the bakery section now, during spring and summer our bakery section is kind of I will not say limited per se but it is not as uh, flourished in our fall and winter catalog so I got two staples um, the first one I got is baked apple pie And it's just a classic apple cinnamon scent. I want to say it's, it's, the cinnamon in it kind of is in between that red hot cinnamon and then also the woodsy fresh bakery cinnamon. But it's, it's very heavy on the cinnamon. So I got this to do some mixing with. Um, cause I have, I have recently acquired on the <laughs> scenting, uh, black market um, some bakery scents that have since retired and I've been on a bakery kick like a lot obsessed probably like the last last week and a half almost two weeks just gourmand baked scents so I'm looking forward to that one on its own and then two for um, another mix mixer and when I say mixers it's like you can add you can you don't have to warm the bars as they are you can if you want to if you like just a regular vanilla scent this is I would highly recommend this one this one is a really good base and uh, it, it's a powerhouse I um, mean it's soft and it's beautiful um, but I also like to mix it when I'm trying to cut down on some sharpness of say like really tart fruit Scentsy bar, or just to add some creaminess into some bakery concoction recipes that I'm coming up with later on in the future, and I may do a video on what I've been mixing uh, with the bakery. And then finally, the last bar I got is in the fruit category. It is skinny dipping. I haven't warmed this bar since I was a customer, <laughs> which is let's see, uh, 2012. So what's that, 11 years? And Skinny Dippin' is beautiful. It's color of cantaloupe. Um, and to me, oh, it is, it is, it is, wow. Get your melon. Um, there's pear, I think, in this. I don't know. It's just a really good medley of, like, the melons. I say honeydew, cantaloupe. You've got, like, a different scent profile with the pear thrown in there I really do love this one and this one is an oldie but goodie and I say oldie but goodie but it's just called a classic scentsy scent and I haven't warmed that in a really long time so I felt it was time to jump back in to the catalog classics and rediscover the awesomeness that is <laughs> you know the standard so that is all that I have for you today I really appreciate you taking the time to watch these videos um, please leave a comment if you like what you see and if you have any suggestions for videos coming up in the future that would be awesome I do think that I will be doing a what I've been warming video um, coming up for my next video on this channel so thank you so much for watching I hope you guys are fantastic and take care